Hey, 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 folks, welcome to my channel. So, today I'm going to do some Jamaican fried dumplings. So, let's get straight into it. In my bowl, I have two cups of all purpose flour. To this, I'm going to add one teaspoon of salt. Three teaspoons of baking powder, three tablespoons of butter. Next, I'm going to mix these ingredients together. Next, I'm going to add some lukewarm water to um, to make to to mix the ingredients to form a dough. Mix the dry ingredients to form a dough. So here's my dough, um, right? And I still have some flour stick up in my hands. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to use some dry flour. Put it in my hands, rub my hands together to get this um, sticky flour mixture on my hands. And what I'm going to do next, I'm going to leave the, um, I'm going to mix it into this piece of dough here. And I'll leave this, let it rest for like about half an hour, or 15 to half an hour, 15 minutes to half an hour. So I'm going to do something else. When I'm done that, this will be enough time for this to give it some, give it enough time to rest. I'm stumbling this morning, guys. Excuse me. So here's my dough. I, this is how I had it in the fridge. I like to wrap it in a piece of um, plastic wrap before I put it in the fridge. And now it's after maybe about 45 minutes. I was doing some other stuff. So I'm going to take off, remove the plastic, knead the dough one more time, and then begin to make them into little balls. Okay, so here's my dough after kneading it again, looking really, really lovely. So I will begin to separate them and form them into balls like I said before. So I'm just going to like take off a small piece of dough like this and just simply just first of all I just start to like fold it in like that and then just begin to roll to kind of perfect the ball and that's it you know that's it let me do one more tear off a small piece of the dough I'll just basically begin to fold it in like that and then just roll so here's my pot on the stove we're gonna basically deep fry in this dough here so of course you have to put a lot of oil so I put the oil in the pot and I have the fire at medium heat and the, fire, the oil is hot now so I'm going to gently spark a little bit, drop that in there, let each one fry. I'm giving each bowl a final shaping before I put them in the oil. Okay, so here we go again. So when I first put each um, ball of dough in the, in the oil, they're going to drop to the bottom. And as they begin to pick up heat, they will, you find they will kind of float to the top of it. Um, you can see what's, what I've been doing here so far. They're basically like what we call mini, they're kind of small, mini fried dumplings. Um, you can make them a little bigger, you know, like this size, maybe about that size, you know. So you can make it like this size or you can make it a little smaller, like mini size. I just easily roll them around, let the entire ball get color. So I could, I have some more space in the pot, so I could put some more in there. Okay, we're coming along very nicely. As the balls begin to take beautiful color all around, like these. Yeah, see how lovely these are looking. We'll just take them out and put them in a plate that I have lined with um, paper towel. I'll take out these right now. It's looking really, really nice. Put them on the side. I have two more to fry. So without, without extra space, I will um, put the extra two to fry. Looking lovely, baby. 
perfect. So here are the fried um, the, the um, fried dumplings looking all yummy and everything. So what I'm going to do next, I'm going to do a presentation for you. So I'll be back. Okay, folks. So here are the fried dumplings. <clears throat> Excuse me, Jamaican fried dumplings. Let me just break into one so you can see what it looks like. Wow, look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Fully cooked and everything. It's a belly full baby. Okay, guys. If you enjoyed this recipe, click on the thumbs up button. Leave a comment for me and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Okay, thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.